Hi there, welcome to Banyan Botanicals. My name is Alicia Diaz and I'm here today to share with you one of the most grounding and nourishing practices in Ayurveda called Abhyanga. Abhyanga is the Ayurvedic term for self-warm oil massage. Here are the things that you'll need to complete your oil massage at home. A squeezable bottle with about two ounces or a quarter cup of your favorite massage oil. A pot with hot water. A large towel to sit on and a warm space so that you don't feel cold or have any drafts while doing your massage. First, place the bottle of oil in the pot of hot water for about five minutes before you start your massage. When it's comfortably warm, take a small amount of oil in your hands and rub your hands together. Start by massaging your scalp. Use your fingertips to really work the oil into your scalp, even gently tugging at the roots of your hair. With each step, take more oil in your hands as you need. Next, move your hands to your face, making circular motions over your forehead and temples, cheeks, nose, upper lip, and chin. Pay special attention to your ears, massaging the whole outer ear, and then placing a small amount of oil on your small finger to massage the ear canal. Use long strokes to massage the front of the neck and the collarbone, then the back of the neck and upper shoulders. Firm long strokes help move lymph to drain toxins, give attention to the length of the muscles, and provide the most grounding touch for the body. Next, move to the arms using long strokes to massage the long bones of the arm. Move from the outside towards the center of the body to bring fluids and lymph back into circulation. Then use circular strokes to massage the joints, the shoulders, elbows, and wrists. Pay special attention to your hands, massaging the palms as well as the knuckles and small joints of each individual finger. Complete one arm and then the other. Moving on to your torso, massage the chest with circular motions. Also, massage the armpits towards the center of the body. Women should pay particular attention to the breasts as massaging this tissue can help drain lymph and keep the tissue healthy. Continue massaging the front of the torso with large circular motions over the entire abdomen starting at the bottom right-hand corner and moving up and over to the left and back around. This motion follows the direction of bowel flow and supports healthy bowel function while massaging the rest of the abdominal and pelvic organ. Be sure to reach under the rib cage to massage the liver, pancreas, and spleen. Once you finish the front of the torso, massage the sides and flanks of the body with long, firm strokes, reaching all the way from the upper rib cage to the hips. Continue the long strokes to reach as much of the back as possible. Complete the back area by massaging the lower back and then naturally move to your hips. Massage your hips with large circular strokes and then move your attention to the buttocks using both long strokes and small circular motions with your fingertips and thumbs to release any areas of tension. Finally, massage your legs and feet as you did your arms. Use long strokes on the long bones moving fluid and lymph back to the center of the body. Use circular strokes on the joints, the knee, ankles, and small joints of the foot. Pay special attention to the sole of the foot and also the toes. This completes your daily warm oil self-massage, a tradition in Ayurveda that says will help nourish and replenish the skin, tone the muscles, calm and soothe the entire nervous system, revitalize and energize the cells of the body, awaken and tune up the functioning of internal organs, and optimize the body's ability to flush and remove toxins. It can even support healthy sleep patterns and energy. As you adopt this practice, we offer the following five practical tips to make the process easier. One, keep a separate towel for this daily habit, as it's difficult to get the smell of oil out of towels. Two, when you wash your hair, 
first apply the shampoo before you wet your hair. Three, take a warm bath or shower after your massage to drive the benefits deeper. Four, minimize the use of soap. Five, take caution walking with oil on your feet as it can be easy to slip and fall.